Hey guys, I'm back. Dollar Tree. I don't know which one I'll put up first. Okay. So, I posted a picture of this. This is the placemat. And I used the wreath form from Dollar Tree. This is ribbon from Dollar Tree that I went around. And this was ribbon I had in my stash. These little denim. And these were Tuesday morning. Oh, I can't remember the name of the brand. But anyway. So yeah, I really like how it came out. Home sweet home. So I made that one. That's hanging out on my deck here. And, oh, I'm working on, oh gosh. Now her name just escaped me. I just was watching her. Kelly Barlow, and she has some great ideas. And these are those little boxes you get at Dollar Tree, and they're three by three. And she stacked them up, so you can even use the drawer. This is the drawer. And then there's the outside part, so you get double. So I really only, so I'm making two of these towers. But it's gonna spell all the seasons, because if you do autumn, winter, spring, and summer, they're all six letter. So like here's autumn. I just picked out Echo Park paper pack. Used my Cricut Joy. Cut out some letters. This is my take on her version of this. So I did autumn. I've got them all almost done. But I just got too tired. I was like, okay. And the, some reason that quit letting me add letters or so I just thought, well, it must be time for me to take a break. So this is summer. And um, I will show you when this is done, the papers that I used. I stained this with two different stain gel stains from um, Michael's. But yeah, I'm excited. I think it's gonna turn out really cute. So these will be stacked up and you can just turn it for whatever season it is. So it'll look like that. Now she stained hers around and stuff, but I think I'm just gonna leave it like this. I'm not gonna do it, make it look too old or vintage or whatever. So yeah, been working on that off and on. And my master's, <laughs> get to the part, the section of my master's where I have to take an examination where they film, I have to film myself taking it. And it's a lot of studying. So that's gonna take a lot of time. And my poor little pea brain, I think I've talked about this before. I'm a little worried. Anywho, I got these from another cutting die from, it's called Judy's, sorry, Judy's Cutting Dies on um, Facebook. It's a group, private group that you can ask to join. She's getting, like I've said before, she's getting them from Allie, I believe, but she does all the, so it says coffee, and look at this cute cup. Oh my gosh, I just had to have it. I'm a coffee lover. Well, there's that. Okay, Dollar Tree. Good Lord. Okay, you ready? Batten down the hatches. Somebody showed they painted these darn cubes. Who, how people think of this stuff? With Waverly white paint, used a little stocking, kid's sock as the hat. You stack up two, you have a snowman. So, God, I have to do that. I mean, my gosh. Um, kind of boring stuff, but I love the grape, and they didn't have it sun-kissed. I like to flavor my water, and they have the Snapple. So I got those. Stickers. I have these, but I just, I got another set. There's that. I just love the little, like the bee, be happy, the bear with the honey. Cute. Um, these are not for me, <laughs> but who doesn't like Mickey and the gang? I mean, seriously, look at all that you get in here. Look at us go. In my old classroom before I had to move to a different smaller Icky Kaka one with seven other women, I don't have issues at all. Anyway, I had a little section that was Mickey, but I don't have any space in there anymore, so and who knows when I'll get to go back. I got this for my refrigerator at the trailer, but I should have gotten one for here, too, so I don't know, maybe someday. Gee, I don't know. Will you think I'll ever go to Dollar Tree again? 
I think it's pretty assured that I will. Um, I got a book. Is this the author that I got before, guys? <laughs> I don't, anyway, I, hopefully it's not the same darn book. It was only a dollar. That's the problem, like my sister said. She goes, the problem with that place is everything's only a dollar, so you buy it. She's right. Look at these. I love these letters and the font, and now they have them in gold. Like, oh my God, I think I've got every color they have. And these are rub-on, which I like, and I like this font. Some people don't like rub-on. I, I kind of do because they're kind of translucent. Oh, should I have these today? These are for Emma at the trailer. Let's note the color. Mm -hmm, trailer color. More of the vinyl latex scrub buddy. These are perfect for crafting, scrubbing things up, whatever you're doing. I am having more fun with my um, bird feeders out here. I mean, it's the hot ticket here in town now. And I'm, I'm the lady of the neighborhood. I counted five birds and three hummingbirds this morning when I got up. Anyway, I enjoy. Um, so we have the yellow goldfinch. All right, you know, so I got this because it reminds me of my birds. Can't have pets, but Emma and I had fun. We sit out in the back, and um, she was hat, and the, I was reading her a story that I got up to, not today, but the other day. So she's liking these little chapter books that are a little bit more than a picture book. She's advancing. So Little Bear's Grandparents. So she and I were reading this, and the neighbor cat came for a visit, so she fed, fed the little cat. I just give her a little kitty treats from the Dollar Tree. Anyway, it was fun. Okay, so I'm not really getting the whole orb thing here, but I want to put a word like hope or believe or something on there, and then I'll like it. Because it's just pitty black. Reminds me of the um, eight ball. Shake it up and find out what your future will be. But this one, I'm hoping to turn into a snowman face and get a, put a snowman. Can you tell I like snowman? Um... And I'm all over the map here, sorry. Elf has their makeup brushes. These are great for crafting too, but these are pretty nice. What does Elf stand for? Elf Cosmetics. Does it stand for something? Yeah, E dot L dot, okay. Anyway, this is a stipple brush. Mm -hmm. So I could do a little gift baskets for my daughter-in-laws or whatever or use them for crafting and then I got this one and I think I got another I thought I got an angle one but maybe not um okay I have a sewing machine I'm terrible at doing the bobbins but I'm gonna figure it out because I am gonna turn these into pillows that's my goal you're a peach I saw this somebody did the other night. seriously I think all I have to do I might not even have to sew it I'll just Tuck this in, Velcro it, and put a pillow form in it, right? There you go. Now I'm feeling even better. And, of course, I love this one's the right color. Good vibes and positive. Good vibes only. So, so don't you think, guys? I can buy a pillow form. Or an old pillow. Ooh, I have an old pillow. <laughs> oh, I took it to the good one. Anyway, <laughs> sorry. But I think this would be a... I don't even think I'll have to sew. Because it's got the back, the front, it's a bag. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You should be nodding right now, right? Okay. Then I got sent to the fall thing. Okay. I bought pizza pans recently because everybody's painting them white, putting the crap on them, and they line go around the circle <laughs> with these. So I found these and I got three because I can't find these often and I can use them. I know I'm in that. Okay. Look at what I found. Oh, I didn't know. Oh, I got Why did I get two of them? Somebody took over my body. Anyway, I got the Bodabra and you need wire. So I got blue. They had this floral wire, but it's not that thick. It's perfect for what I want it for. For purple. Again, I, I don't know if the light is terrible. Silver. 
gold, and red. Anywho, I got more than one of a couple colors. I think I must have been delirious or something and just throwing them in the cart. Um, Muriel, Miss Cooper's Coop, had a video. She's doing her Christmas in July series. I love that series, so thank you, Muriel. I watch on my TV, so I don't always comment or like, and I feel bad. Okay. Anyway, Muriel, if you watch... She altered these. She put some cute decoration, like a belly band around with a rosettes for Christmas. So I got a blue. I don't know who I'm giving all this stuff to. <laughs> it's like, what do you think? Anyway, and I got a pink because it's Christmas. It's school time. I thought I might sell some of this on Facebook Marketplace or something. I don't know. Um, Dermasil. Take this to the trailer. So I have, I'm trying to. I bought little containers and wrote on the top, multivitamin, vitamin D on the top so that I just have it there and I have my regular stuff here because the back and forth thing is kind of driving me a little nutty. Oh, I didn't realize I did that. Home sweet home, isn't that pretty? Let's see through right here. So I could, could I almost put like, I think I'll put like a teal piece of paper behind that. So that's, anyway, we shall see. I probably already have this from last year, but isn't that gorgeous? A velvet pumpkin in its teal. Yeah, I think I already have one of those, but that's okay. Um, I was started to, I did a load to the local thrift store, broke down a bunch of boxes, started kind of getting organized in my garage, found a bunch of fall stuff, but I'd already bought this. Anyway. I want the leaves, like on that pumpkin be cute. I want these little pumpkins and I like the leaves. And I got these. So I, but after finding that other bunch, I was like, all right, Kim, you don't need any more. I did find this ribbon that I liked. I want to try with my boo -debra. Probably, I don't know, how much is on here? 108 inches, three yards, nine, three yards, nine feet. Three yards. All right, then all the fall stuff. Oh, before I get to the fall decorations. Okay, pizza pan, paint it white, put something like this on there. Isn't that cute? So always wash your hands, flush the toilet, close the lid. I'm not a big on the close the lid. As long as they, men put the seat down, I don't need the lid down. Anyway, that's just me. Floss. Oh and brush your teeth. Why is it all, it's like that little weird line. But, um, so, yeah. I might put these when I return to the classroom, always wash your hands. That would be a good one for there. So, if I remember and I have it by the time I go back. Okay, still we don't know what we're doing here. It's like everybody debates, it's like, I we don't know, so let's just not even, what's the point, people? Okay, so I got some signs. They had one tr um, red truck thing that was kind of the way it was painted. It looked weird, but I did like this one, so this isn't for me. I think it's cute. I guess you could put it outside, but it's paper on top of wood, so MDF, so I don't know. Might not last. Um, but they had the red truck harvest blessings. What is with the red truck? How did that become a thing? Harvest blessings. But I'm all in. I'm in, baby. Count me in, baby. Sunflower. Metal. And then they have another one. And then they have, and they had it before, corn metal. And I thought, oh, that's kind of cute. I like that. Another red truck. Hello, fall. Isn't that gorgeous, though? Why not a blue truck? Why red? If you know the reason it's red is big, let me know. Is there some symbolism behind this? This is absolutely gorgeous, and I wish I sent something off to a friend that loves sunflowers already. Otherwise, this would have been a part of it. Isn't that gorgeous? Give thanks. This one's for me. Yeah. Like I said, I would have sent it to my sunflower loving friend, but... 
I'm sure she's already figured out. So something's on its way and it had a sunflower seed. Seed. Sunflower theme. So this would have been perfect. It's like, ah, oh well. All right. Grateful, thankful, blessed. But I think what I'll end up doing is after the season is change these or before this even alter these somehow because I really like the shape and keep the wood behind it but put something else on there. I don't know what yet. I look at everything at the darn Dollar Tree now as a craft. What can I do to it? I bought this because I liked, of course, the color. I didn't realize it was a peace sign, but I'm going to put something here anyway. I have, a as a divorced single woman, I have an issue. Welcome to our home. Bless our home. Our. I'm a one. Uno. <laughs> so I'm going to put welcome to my home or bless my home. There. So that's why I bought this special moments collection. This is another green bright. I mean, it's amazing. But don't you think that'd be pretty inside? So there you go. And this is gorgeous. And again, I don't know if I'll keep that as a sign and then I can you can change if you get tired of that side alter this side right double you can just whoop, flip it flip it baby and I've been seeing people show this I just think this is awesome welcome the Wi-Fi password is I'm gonna put this in my craft room so when people are up there with their you know if they bring their technology with them they will know my password so that they can log in and that is that, guys. Yay! All right. My next video that I will be putting up is um, my drawing. Okay? So stay tuned for that. All right. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.